Okay, ladies and gentlemen, please come close. This is a behind the scenes thing here. Come right up close. We don't smell, I promise. We've been working hard, but we're okay. Come close. So, um, I thought what we'd do is just have a, a quick insight. As you can see, we're in our working clothes. We've been setting up for the last three hours for this gig. And uh, Mauricio said that it'd be nice to just explain a little bit about how we put the band together. So, um, let's start off by getting you to clap. Can you clap the clave for it? Going, the tendency is to speed up when you're clapping as a group. So listen to yourself and listen to Dave and don't speed up. As musicians, when we train, we learn not to speed up when we're playing wherever possible. So we can have that really settled thing. Dave Patman from Wood Green in London has got a metronome in his head and he's just so solid. So, from that, we're going to add the congas now, and Emerys is going to play the conga tumbao. That's the heartbeat of the band. That is the heartbeat. He doesn't do any fancy stuff, he just keeps the band going. And now we're going to add the bass tumbao. which is the side of the timbales. Now keep clapping, Dave is going to stop playing the clave and do a double cascara. You see, none of these guys are actually playing the clave. It's implied. And a common mistake is to think that we play the clave. We don't generally play the clave. We just imply it in everything that we do. 